Hello everyone! For those of you who are wondering, yes, I have gotten Super Mario Wonder and I've played the first couple worlds, but college has left me quite busy and unfortunately I don't quite have time to do the good thing, bad thing video that I wanted to do quite yet, so excuse this for now, but um, we're gonna have to do a little bit of filler content today and react to a booster course uh, wave 6, and I have not seen this video, I got a feeling I know what I'm gonna see, but this is my genuine first reaction to the trailer at least, so let's make sure the volume is up, and let's take a listen. Alright. Yep, I got a feeling we Rainbow Road is coming back. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. That looks so awesome, and it's an anti-gravity too, and you can see the track bouncing up and down. Oh wow. And this, oh my gosh, and the song sounds fantastic too. I'm having like a Nathaniel Bandy moment right here where it's like, oh my god, Cheeseland! No, but seriously, I'm having like a Nathaniel Bandy moment right now. This looks fantastic. And I knew it was coming because I saw it in... But... Wow. And the music sounds phenomenal. And I'm turning it down because I want to make sure you hear me, not because I dislike the music. Wow, okay, so there's... Oh, is that... Pa I think I just saw Pauline on there. So we know Pauline's coming in. Alright, are they going to show another track, though? Tour Madrid Drive. Okay, obviously I'm not very familiar with the tour games. Y'all know my thoughts on that, but... Okay, so it looks like you race through a soccer stadium with giant soccer balls, though. Interesting stuff. And then DK Mountain is coming back again. Okay, so that was in Mario Kart Wii, and looks like that's coming back. Um, obviously it's time you glide out of the cannon. Oh, there's Funky Khan, of course. The man, the myth, the legend. Weed Daisy Circuit. Yeah, I think I had heard that this one was coming back. This is an interesting choice, I suppose. Um, I, I guess I'm glad to see it back. Good old nostalgic Wii track. Piranha Plant Cove from Mario Kart Tour. Again, another one I'm not super familiar with, but it looks like, as we see here, there's piranha plants and there's PD Piranha racing along. Um, I'm still loving the Rainbow Road music here that's playing in the background, by the way. All right. SNES Bowser Castle 3. Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa. They're actually doing something with one of these SNES tracks, because, first of all, they don't do much with the SNES tracks anyway, because it's like, they did, they did Donut Plains 3, and they did a couple other little SNES things in this game. I don't know, they haven't done much with Super Mario Kart, but... It looks like they've really put some effort into this one. Wow, and I forgot about, I didn't hear about this particular track coming in. So, yeah, like, look at this route. Well, they're not going to show much of it, but it's impressive. Looks like they they genuinely tried to remake that one. And then Tor Rome Avanti. I don't know what an Avanti is, but okay, there's Pauline Racing, looking great. And here is Rosalina's Ice World. I've never played much Mario Kart 7, but this game, or this track does look, oh, and it looks very serene right there. That definitely gives off the Super Mario Galaxy vibes. You see the galaxies in the background. Oh, how lovely. Well, that's exciting. So, does there an actual, usually there's not an actual release date for this. Okay, and, oh, wow. Alright, so we have a ton of new characters coming in. I had a feeling a, a lot of these guys were coming in, but so we got Birdo, Petey Piranha, Diddy Con, Funky Con, who of course I love, Wiggler, Comic, Peachette, whatever, <laughs> another Peach clone because we need another one of those, and Pauline. Well, out of these characters, I am definitely most excited about Funky Con and Pauline, as and probably least excited about Wiggler and Peachette, but I'll, I'll take them, whatever. All right, so it's, oh, there is an actual release date, and this comes out November 9th. Oh, that's actually, I was expecting it to be like some sort of Christmas gift or something. All right, well, I'm going to have to do, I was not expecting it this early, so I'm going to have to do freaking 
my thoughts on the track right after I do some Super Mario Bros. Or not even Super Mario Wonder content. I'm gonna have to do both of those together. Wow. Alrighty, Nintendo will keep me busy then. And then all this stuff at the end. Well, needless to say, as a uh, my loyal subscriber fiction fanboy commented, I think you can tell which track I'm most excited about. It would be Wii Rainbow Road, since that is my favorite nostalgic track right there from Mario Kart Wii. I am super excited to see that one come back. But I'm also excited to see some of those other tracks. The, uh, was that tour track? What was that one called? The one that's in the soccer stadium, Madrid Drive. That looks interesting. You got some tracks from Mario Kart Wii coming back, like DK Mountain, which of course was in that game, and Daisy Circuit, so some more Wii nostalgia right there. And then, yeah, this one right here, Bowser Castle 3. Just, just from that screenshot alone, it looks like they really did a lot for that particular track, considering it was obviously a flat Super Mario Kart course at first. So, I'm very excited. What else can I say? All right. I will see you hopefully soon for some Super Mario Wonder content, but until then, bye-bye.